So I just ran the farm for about 10 minutes. <clears throat> I did my best to hit the switch right at as I hit start and then right, uh, right as 10 minutes is up. Uh, I flicked the lever and I got 9,562 or almost three double chests worth. Now that is basically 57,372 per module per hour. So if you want over 100,000 items, just build two of these. <laughs> yeah, that is an insane amount of cobble. I'm gonna hop over into the testing world where I built this and just kind of run you guys through some, some notes about this. All right, there's a couple things to know about the build. This is the bare minimum, no sorting system or, or anything like that to just get this remote going. Um, just add four ice, some packed ice so it doesn't melt to the build, plus however much it is for the sorting system that you wanna build. You definitely want a sorting system because it produces so many items that just a few hoppers won't suffice. Um, another thing to note, if you don't want to hear TNT explosions, it's 64 blocks away. Let me get this started and so you guys can kind of hear what I mean. And so from back here, can't hear. This is 64 blocks away. This is the 65th block. These, this is 64. And as soon as we cross this, we can hear. Let me turn up the sound. You can't hear it at all. Let me... No sound. I guess you can hear it just as you're touching the uh, 65th block or 64th block. And then for the sorting system, it's needed because of how many items come through. Basically one hopper or just a handful of hoppers doesn't push the items up fast enough. Otherwise they'll get stuck. So having some sort of like flowing sorting system is definitely beneficial because even if the hoppers are full from how much items are coming through, they'll still get sorted out through the line and maybe even having like a overflow protection, some like cactus or lava, whatever the system that you have is, definitely, definitely would recommend if you're gonna be running it for a long time, just in case you forget about it and you don't have, you know, tens of thousands of items on the ground. But if you build a large enough sorting system, it should be fine. The only time it's gonna get really jammed up is when there's not enough space. If you guys have any questions, I guess just ask it down in the, uh, the comment section there. If you guys have any questions, like I said, just put them down in the comment section. I'll be trying my best to answer them. And yeah, well, hope you guys have a wonderful day and I'll catch you guys in the next video. Bye.